Shot in broad daylight, the victim hitting the ground. But the story doesn't end there. Police say the shooter stood over the victim and fired two more shots. James Munoz is live at police headquarters with the latest. James. Police also say the shooter fired at an eyewitness. That person was not hurt. The suspect then drove here to SAPD headquarters with the weapon to explain what happened. The shooter is at police headquarters. He actually drove himself to police headquarters to tell his side of the story, I suspect. San Antonio police are trying to piece together why an off-duty security guard would open fire on a neighbor. It all started when the suspect drove by upsetting the victim in the 800 block of Utopia Lane. He shouted at the driver to slow down. The driver stops, gets out, fires a, uh, fires a shot at him, hits him in the head. He goes down. Reportedly, he walks up to him, fires two more in him while he's on the ground. Um, and takes off. An eyewitness followed the shooter and even confronted him by ramming his vehicle into the suspect's car. Shots rang out again. The witness backed off and reported to police. Well, the remark that I made to the deputy chief up there was that he'll be getting a, a citizen's award next year. The victim was hit three times. At last report, he was in critical condition at an area hospital. Back out live now, the suspect is inside police headquarters right now being questioned. We may have a look at him tonight at 10 o'clock. Again, the suspect and victim lived along the same street. They may have had issues in the past, so it's possible this was an ongoing dispute between them. We'll learn more tonight. The victim's name has not been released. We know he's 41 years old. Reporting live, James Munoz, Kins 5 Eyewitness News. All right, James, thank you.